Welcome to Kid Connection. We are going to learn about the good news that God gave us in the Bible. But first, we need to sing our startup song, Living Inside Out. Ready? Everybody up, let's sing. job. Now let's sing a song that helps us every time we pray. God is listening. Let's sing.
Our episode is called Snow Day, Learning About Jesus. Our verse is, all who believed in him became the children of God. John 1.12. Let's say that together. You ready? One, two, three. All who believed in him became the children of God. John 1.12. Great job. We learn things every day. I am always learning things. But where do you learn things? What kinds of things do you like to learn? We learn things at school and church. We learn things from our parents and friends. We learn things from books, games, the internet, and even TV. But most, but here is the most important thing you could ever learn. You learn about Jesus. Charlotte! Charlotte, where are you? I have lunch ready. Hmm. Have you guys seen Charlotte? She came over to have lunch with Papa and me and I've got lunch already, but I can't find her anywhere. Oh well, I'll go look someplace else. Charlotte! Charlotte, are you here? Charlotte! Well, she's not here either. Oh well, I'll have to go look one more place. It's cold out here today. It's really windy. I bet she's cold and ready to come in for some lunch. Charlotte! Charlotte, are you out here? Charlotte! Oh! There you are! What have you been doing? I've been helping Papa on the tractor. You have? It's cold out here, isn't it? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Well, are you guys ready for lunch? I oh, have lunch, lunch ready. Yeah. 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 All right. Well, let's right. go let's have go some lunch. lunch. We turn the lights out. When Jesus was 12 years old, he and his family went on a trip to Jerusalem to celebrate the Passover festival. They traveled with friends and family from their home. They had a great time celebrating God's protection for their people when they were in Egypt. Then, when they were leaving Jerusalem, something strange happened to Mary and Joseph. Let's watch. Small baby Jesus, so meek and so mild. He grew until he was a 12-year-old child. He loved his mom, Mary, and Joseph, his dad. And he loved to climb trees like any young lad. Once he landed, they heard to the right of the board some music and dancing and praising the Lord. Every year in Jerusalem, they deck the fine city for the Passover party. It was really quite pretty. So the three, out they journeyed, downhill and down trail, for in those days there was no electronic mail. They went over a stream to arrive at the gate and saw the fun party in a high spirit state. With dancing and cheering and oversized food, those Passover people were in a fun-loving mood. Mary and Joseph and Jesus hung out with the partying people till there was no doubt that they had to depart and not bandy about. As they crossed back over the trail through the land, both parents looked down. Jesus was not at hand. They looked under rock, up the trees, and downstream, for they hoped that this was just a horrible dream, for Jesus, it seemed, had slipped through a seam, lost where no one could find him. 
they looked for three days and finally went to Jerusalem, back to the Passover event. Exclamation points formed as they looked with surprise. Jesus was teaching the teachers, so wise. I'm right here, Jesus said. Where else would I be? In the house of my father. Wouldn't you agree? You might not understand now. You will see. And with that, they all made their way home. And so that's the tale of Temple Taught teachers who thought they were some of the most gifted preachers till 12-year-old Jesus sent them back to the bleachers. He knew what to say. He showed them the way of God's love and to love one another. When Mary and Joseph finally found Jesus, they were so relieved, just like when I found Charlotte after looking and looking for her. What was Jesus doing? He was learning about God, but also he was teaching. The leaders were asking Jesus questions, even though he was just 12 years old. Just like the leaders, we learn about Jesus by asking questions. When Mary and Joseph thought Jesus was lost, they looked and looked for him and finally found him after three days. They didn't give up after a few hours, and we need to not give up either. Where do we find Jesus? We find him in the Bible. We find him when we pray. We find him when we ask questions about him. When we find him, we learn about Jesus. Let's pray. Dear Lord, thank you so much that you have given us opportunity to find you and to learn about you. Help us as we search. Help us as we discover. Help us not to give up, but to keep going, to read our Bibles, to talk to you. Help us, Lord, as we search for you because you are always there. And I thank you for that, Jesus. Amen.